Hey guys, quick interruption. Before this video starts, I uh, just want to answer a question from the previous video that I missed. Uh, it came in late. I apologize. It's from Jacob Winlock, aka Lip. He asks, if I could uh, sit down and eat with four people, who would they be? Uh, hmm. That's a tough question. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it in two distinct categories. The old age and the modern age. The old age, I'm going to people from the past, and the modern age, people that are now. Four people that I could sit with and chill with in, in the old age, maybe, um, hmm, Charlie Chaplin. Why? Because why not? Mark Twain, because I feel like Mark Twain would always have something funny to say. I guess uh, Jim Varney, because Jim Varney, uh, he, he, he passed away a, a while ago. He would be a cool person to chill with. And um, maybe John Candy. Now, as far as modern age, people that I like to hang with now, uh, Billie Eilish, obviously. The Weeknd, obviously. Eminem, probably. Uh, uh, Quentin Tarantino, without a doubt. So those, those are the four people that I'd hang out with. All right, now on to your regularly, regularly scheduled video. Hey, what's up, you guys, and welcome to ATV. Now, this video is basically a request uh, from a comment that I received on my previous video right here. They asked if I could do another updated autograph video, and it occurred to me that I haven't done an autograph update since last October. Um, and there's a reason for that, you know. I stopped collecting for a little while. Um, I wasn't buying as much autographs uh, anymore. The last big place that I went to was to the uh, horror convention known as Days of the Dead in Atlanta uh, this previous February. And I did get a bunch of autographs from there and uh, it occurred to me that I don't think I have showed those either. So I, I, I could show you those um, and uh, we'll see where we go from there. So this is the updated autograph collection video starting now. Alright, so the first one is Tom Savini. I, I just met him uh, in February at the convention. Super chill guy. I, I knew I had to meet that guy because he was so cool. I have a lot of uh, horror ones, so let's open it up. Right here we have uh, Adrian King, who played Alice from Friday the 13th, and she wrote Austin. Uh, then he's still there. Adrian King, Alice. Right under Alice we have Amy Steele, who played Jenny from Friday the 13th Part 2. She wrote, Austin, there's someone in this fucking room. And I was like, wow, that's freaking awesome. I also finally got Henry Thomas, Elliot from E.T. to sign uh, my E.T. picture. I told you last time uh, that I showed this picture off. Uh, it was only signed by D. Wallace and, and, and the older brother from, from the film. And, I, and uh, Henry Thomas could not make it to the convention. He was like filming a movie or something. But he actually made it there this year as well, so I got him to sign it as well. So now I have all three signatures on the page. I, I mean, I, I, except for like Drew Barrymore, but that's a whole. I have an autograph for that as well. So, pretty cool. Uh, this is Billy Zane from Titanic. Uh, I just got this one in uh, in February. He wrote Austin, make your own luck. Billy Zane. He was such a cool dude. He was one of the highlights of the trip. Um, oh, the next one is really freaking cool. Uh, this is Corey Taylor. I met Corey Taylor from Slipknot um, in February. He wrote to Austin, Corey Taylor, and I also got a picture with him. So there's me and Corey Taylor from Slipknot and Stone Sour. Uh, right here, we got the guy who played Francis from, you guessed it, Pee Wee's Big Adventure. He wrote, you'll be sorry, Austin, Francis. I love this guy. He was actually in a, another movie called Gacy. He played John Wayne Gacy, another creepy film. Uh, and so I met him. And over here is Ginger Lynn. Yes, the porn star. But she's from, uh, she's in the movie uh, Devil's Rejects, so I had to meet her. She wrote, to Austin, laugh, clown, laugh, Ginger Lynn. Actually, I do want to show you something. She gave me a um, this little poker chip as well. It's this lit. If I can focus on it, it's this little poker chip that shows her and Sid, Sid Haig, rest in peace, um, kissing. I don't know if you can. Let me get in the light. There you go. 
As you can see, the, this side shows them kissing, and on the other side, it's just a picture of her. And she said, and I quote, uh, if you play this chip in a uh, in a poker game, tell them it's worth a thousand point. Uh, tell them it's worth a thousand. I'm like, wow. So she gave me this little token as well. Uh, I think we're near the end. We got we don't have much. Um, this is Roger L. Jackson, who played Ghostface, or he was the voice of Ghostface from all the Scream films. He wrote to Austin, "What's your favorite scary movie?" Roger L. Jackson, Ghostface. It's so cool too because he um, he walked up to me, and well, he didn't walk up to me. I walked up to him and sat next to him. And took a picture with him, and uh, he also did the uh, he did the voice while we were sitting there. It was pretty cool. I think we are all we're near the end. Yeah, this is the last one. Unfortunately, uh, I met uh, Murr from Impractical Jokers. I also got a picture with him as well. He wrote to Austin, and he wrote his signature. He wrote Murr um, from Impractical Jokers, and that was all literally all the autographs that I have collected since then. There really hasn't been many um, to really show for. But um, I hope to get more in the future. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this autograph video. Even though it was a short one, um, I hope to start collecting more in the future. It's just expensive. I do plan to go to the convention, uh, Days of the Dead, next year. Blah, next year. Um, in February, I believe. January or February. I think it's January of 2023 in... Uh, Atlanta, uh, but I do also plan to get some more autographs in the future. It's just been a weird couple of months, so I just haven't been collecting, um, but I do plan to get back into it. Um, if you want to follow me on my social medias, I'll put them right here, and I'll see you guys next time on ATV. Peace.